He is a legend and he has contributed a lot in the Gambia football team. When he joined the Gambia national team, I wasn't born by then and when he was playing, um, I was really young as well, but I'm so glad that people really recommended him and he truly, truly deserved to be celebrated not only in Gambia, but globally as well. He is a former Gambian football player, a true Gambian legend, with a remarkable football career that cemented its image throughout the length and the breadth of the footballing world. He is a Gambian born in Bunun, Sarekunda County Municipality. He attended Sarekunda Primary School where he headed the school football team. He proceeded to Latikunda Upper Basic School where he played for both junior and senior teams. During Nevertan, he played for SK Motel, also a second division team called Linked XT Football Club. Our legend, our celebrant is Chato Sise. He joined the Gambian national team in 1992 and he was the youngest by the time. During his time at the Gambian national team, Jato represented Gambia in encounters against Guinea Bissau, Senegal, Mali, Congo, South Africa, Lesotho, Ghana, Niger, Morocco, Murtani, and many other countries. He retired from the Gambian national team in 2005. He is the first Gambian to receive the Best Player Award in the Gambia by the Le Ozava. He was voted in Holland as the African second best player in Dutch League in 1999. Cheto is really amazing. Cheto has an amazing career. He has played for Walden in the Gambia, RW, DM, Montbeck in Belgium, Birmingham City in England, William II in Holland. While playing with William II, he participated in glorious European Cup, Champions League competitions. He was the only player in William II that has played all his Champions League games. This is incredible. Also played in one of the biggest clubs in Saudi Arabia called Al Hilal Football Club for two years. He played Arab Championship with Al Hilal. In 2007, he played with AEK Lanaka Football Club, one of the biggest clubs in Cyprus for two years. He also played Pop Horse Football Club in Cyprus for one year. Although our legend, Teto Sise, our celebrant, has retired from playing football, but his memories and what he did for the Gambia will never be forgotten. Teto is a hero. I think we need to celebrate Teto. He's a sport icon. During his days, Navetan was properly conducted across the greater Banjul area. He's so case uh, one of the rare talent that one can find within the country. Although I had they said there were a lot of great players in the past, but for me, I think Jadro has really showcased one of the greatest talent of his generation. He shared the platform with a lot of people, but he, he superseded a lot of them. And that's one of the reasons he applied his trade on the international. Um, only hopeful that he will come back and help the struggling game in the Gambia. Well, now he's a retired player, but I wish him good luck because he's a very dedicated and a determined player. I hope we will celebrate him and continue to celebrate him forever. Very pleased to talk about Jado Sise, a Gambian player whom you know. He played for the senior national team and he also played for Walidan Banju club team. He, as a leader of the Gambia football, did so many good things for the Gambia. And I believe we need players like Jato Sise. Jato Sise was among one of the Gambian's finest players ever who played for the senior national team. And during his career, I was a small girl, but I used to heard so many things about him, being a very good goal scorer, also doing all sacrifice to make some Gambian team qualify for African Cup of Nations or any football competition. Jato Sise serves as a role model and I believe Gambians should always celebrate him because the good job he did for the country. As a great leader, he did not only stop at playing football, but during his professional days in William II, he makes sure so he gave back to his country, whether male or female teams. 
as a player before at Star Lions, currently called now Abuko United. Jato Sise sponsored the team when we won the second division league to the first division. He sponsored the team with 15 footballs and a set of jersey from William II. That was a great source of motivation for the entire Abuko United team and the community at large because we needed support in those days as champions going to the first division we need football equipment more so he did when we needed so that we were proud of him for being that great hero and the sponsor of Eastern Lion now Abuko United to the first division team he did not only stop at Eastern Lions he also sponsored so many football teams both male and female so we are here to say that Osise is someone whom you know. He did so much for the Gambians and we shall never forget all the good things he do. Also to his family, mom and brothers, they also support and they love football. Especially her mother. May her beautiful soul rest in perfect peace. She was a great fan of Gambian football. Not only male and also female. Because Abuko United then the Eastern Lions do have problems in camping, so you do step in and help the team. So that kind of gesture we cannot forget, and we always pray to Allah to guide him and his family. Also, to the general Gambians, football fans, stakeholders, and everyone, Jato Sise is a key player, was a key player that you know, every player mate will love to play with him, because he got all the leadership qualities, He's a good role model. He manifests all what he did, all the sacrifice to make sure Gambians get to where we are today. So for that being the case, we are very, very pleased to sit and talk about who Jato Sise was. As a dreamer, his dreams come true because all the goals he scored for the country, he stopped playing football for the senior national team in 2006. Also, his international professional career, career in 2012. So Gambians are still awake and we are all aware of all the good things he did. Likewise, his teammates, we are praying for the Almighty Allah to continue to guide you, bless you abundantly and your family. May all your dreams come true. In fact, life after football, we are also encouraging him and his player mates to come back to football like to be administrators or coaching in any other field they believe it can strengthen in Gambian football. Those are my wishes for Gambian footballers, whom you know they are his teammates and also play for the Gambia in professional levels. We are proud of you all, especially Jato Sise, whom you know was a team leader and a former captain of Gambia's senior national team. We need to celebrate Jato. He's a legend. He did a lot for the country. Like I remember when I was young, watching Jato playing football for the Gambia. Everybody is proud of him. When he's inside the pitch, he did a lot for the country. He gave wholeheartedly for the country. Without Jato in the pitch, it's just like we don't have Messi or Ronaldo in the pitch. He's a legend. I think we need to celebrate him. Yeah. He sacrificed a lot. He did a lot for the country. Diamonds are proud of him. And when he's out of the country also to play for international, he did a lot for his club. And we need to celebrate him as a legend. That is a proud somebody. Yeah, all of the country is proud of him. We need to celebrate him. Jato is a legend. He's an icon to the country. Jato is, is a living legend who deserves to be celebrated. Yeah, since life is a give and take, he did a lot and I believe he deserves a lot too. So celebrating him is something that he really deserves. Jato have did a lot 
for the Gambia and Gambians. He took the, flag, the, the national flag of the Gambia to a higher level, whereas, I mean, it was remarkable in the sense of in the sense that yeah, what he achieved in football and for Gambia and as well because anywhere he was he represented the Gambia, not him alone. He was a, a leader as a captain of the Gambia national team. His leadership doesn't only enter the field, it went far to off field because uh Many people have went through him, both football and uh, even in terms of education and uh, many other areas. Yes, he have did a lot, he have did a lot. Jato, Jato was for everybody, he was for everybody. There came a time when he was in, when he was in, in Holland, where he first started his professional career. He was like an ambassador. He was like an ambassador. Anybody who came from Gambia, and then the moment you reach in uh, Holland, no matter what situation you are into, when you just call the name of Jato, well, he will come to you and did whatever necessary you deserve, or uh, he, he can do for you. Jato has tried a lot, he tried a lot. And he is still trying, though he is no more playing, but he is still trying. Those who know him very well can attest to this. On, on, on many occasions, many occasions, a lot of people will go through certain things, whereas he will intervene. Knowing that all, since childhood, up to date, he is straightforward, he loves what he did most. And he all whatever he have is for for the people. I can remember there was a time when when he comes to the Gambia, if you go to his house it would be like a festival. When you just ask him what are this all these people here for? He said he is working for the people. So celebrating him is something which he really deserves because it sees it shows that the people he was doing for have appreciated all his sacrifice and the effort. Without celebrating him, will he, I will just see it as he will be disappointed because uh, it will tell him that all your sacrifices haven't been appreciated. So celebrating him, definitely, he deserves it and uh, he is a legend, a legend. <laughs> well, I'm a... Gambian born and bred, um, it's um, indeed a proud moment for me, a really proud moment for me, uh, simply because the people um, have recognized my efforts and sacrifices, um, um, you know, um, for them, because all what I did was for the people, so it's an honor to see the same people, um, uh, to be appreciated by the same people. Uh, I serve with my best ability. Uh, as life says, um, life is all about um, give and take. Um, uh, so it's a honor to me seeing um, people celebrating me as a, as a legend in return of what I did for them um, as a sign of appreciation um, from them. Uh, the only thing I can say, they have me proud. They have me really, really, really proud. Um, uh, I want to say to each and everybody, I appreciate each and everybody. Um, too much love for everybody, too much respect for everybody. Um, once again, Thank you. Ciao. Jeto Sise, our celebrant, we celebrate you today and forever. We are so proud of you. I know I was really young when you were playing football and I wish I could watch you play. Nonetheless, I'm so proud of you. It was great hearing from people 
about the incredible work that you did in the Gambia and we shall always remember you and we shall always support and appreciate what you did for the Gambia. May you live long, continue to stay blessed. We celebrate you, Jato Sise. You are a legend. And Gambian football team, we always remember you. I have no doubt that any time Gambian football is named somewhere, your name shall be in the front line. Thank you for everything. We celebrate you.